In this short tutorial, I will show you how to create ANPR blacklist and the event so the alarm is triggered once not loud vehicle will appear in front of our ANPR cameras. So let's start. First, we need to create the watch list. So go to settings, go to person and vehicle information, then switch to vehicle list. Over here, you can create a new identity, new license plate. So click on add. Over here, add the license plate. For example, CB123. You can also specify the vehicle color. This is no needed. You can specify this car to uh, allow him for the vehicle and entrance, if you have one. But this video is about the arming. So we are going to go to vehicle arming group. So allow this, then add this license plate to that list. And now choose the arming group. You can choose the one which is already created or create your own one. So we will create now the new vehicle arming group. For example, webinar. You can create the color for that group, for example, red, and click on add. Now select this group, webinar group, or it can be thief group, whatever, and click on OK. So now the car is already in the arming group, in the blacklist or whitelist or watchlist, however you want to call it. So this is in webinar group. Now, we need to create action for that. So go back to home, go to event, add a new event, click on video channel, scroll all the way down. And here you got vehicle arming. So you can choose the group, for example, high risk vehicles, or thief vehicles, or the one which I just created, the webinar group. Now select for which camera it should apply. So in case the car with such a license plate is in front of one or two cameras or multiple cameras, so you can also select the groups or whole route. What should be done? For example, link action, link video, even source. So I want to see the camera where the car was captured. I can start recording and streaming. I can allow the pop-up for the operator. I can also trigger the snapshot, even source. So even if it's a different camera, it's always even source. It's always the camera which Spotify the car. I can also trigger some lights, trigger some uh, other event, whatever I want. Now I will select which operator should receive such an alarm and just click OK. So now everything is created. So in case car will appear, car with such a license plate will appear in front of the camera, the, ca the camera will pop up on operator screen. Okay, it's easy. So thank you very much for watching this short tutorial.